Where are you going? Good afternoon. It is Thursday, the 30th of March. It is day four of the 100 day challenge. I'm standing here in the chicken yard, uh, ready to give you a report on how things are going so far. We had some excitement here at our nuclear homestead, Chopwood Farm, uh, mainly around this guy. This is Mighty Marco, and he's finding a new home, because he's a psycho. It could be Psycho Marco. So Reese the Rabbit, Sheriff of Chicken Town, was living over here. The other day, Luke, the nine-year-old, comes out and says, Hey, I can't find Reese. I don't know where he went. So we start looking all around. It's twilight. Lights are out. The sun's going down. And I'm looking around, looking for where the rabbit could have crawled out from under the fence, even though I've got predator wire all around. Mom is over here and she says, No, that's not what she says. She says, he's in here, pointing at the, the rooster. Now this rooster is big and he's mean and he's crazy. That's why he's in solitary confinement, because uh, he is big, mean, and crazy. I thought that Mighty Marco had hurt the, the rabbit and his carcass was laying in here. That was not the case. The rabbit was just hiding back in there. Uh, had to put Luke inside the playpen to crawl back there while I held Mighty Marco upside down by his feet. He was totally chill. I'm totally chill. And then he was hypnotized. Once everybody was rescued, I put him back in. But this is what we're doing. Everything is fine now. It's a leaf in the water. It's been kind of rainy, as you can see from the sky above me. The chickens have really been enjoying their chicken yard. You can tell the difference between where they are, where the grass here. They really are not crazy about the long green stuff, but they totally are digging the clover type, whatever this is. It's this stuff here on the other side of the fence. I bet they could, if they could get to that, they would. Part of my plan is for this fence row to be where my happies go. My happies are the sunflowers. Mama loves the sunflowers. And then right here along this stretch is where the amaranth is going to grow because it's a grain and the ladies like that. Gate still working. Mama asked today if we could paint it. I don't see why not. And some exciting news. During a huge rainstorm that we had, I mean, it was really coming down. Uh, so much so that all the ladies were hiding under the, the, the old coop right under here. All four of them trying to fit in a space that only is designed to hold two inside. We had to come out, grab them, and put them in the bigger coop. So during that rainstorm, this, I'm not sure what to call it, greenhouse, cold frame, hothouse, I'm not sure. It's where my seedlings are, um, but it's jamming. Uh, it got flooded, so I came out the other day to poke some holes in the pans uh, to let any kind of residual water drain out so my plants aren't uh, drowning, and look at what I found. It's already starting. Now the cool thing is, I've got seedlings coming up. The bad part is, I don't know what they are. See, what happened was, I made all these little tags, right? These are zucchini, this is a pumpkin, P-M-K-N. That spells pumpkin. It's a butternut, that's a jalapeno. These are three cabbages, I ran out of little tags. Here you can see one of them, oh it's warm in here has come out. So this is probably 
some type of tomato. It says beef steak, it's actually boxcar willy. These could be green beans because they're in the row, the line here with green beans, but if that's the case, why are they sprouting and this is not? Here's a green bean seed right here, in fact. Let me poke that back in. Oh, 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 did you see this? Why didn't you tell me? Look, the chard is coming up. There's Swiss chard and rainbow chard. Back there is spinach. But look at that. Look at that life. Look at that. Look at that, huh? And this, my arugula. That was yummy. Here, parsley, sage, rosemary. I'm growing inside. Let's check out what's going on over here. Look at this. Look at the cabbage. It's bolting, get ready to flower. That means cabbage seeds. That's fantastic. These mung beans, they are munging. Reese the bunny. Hey Reese. Oh. He said to come in here after his big adventure. How you doing, big guy? You're gonna go back out there soon. I say soon, don't tell Reese, but I don't know how soon. Let's check the little ones out. Hello, little ones. <laughs> and one other thing that I've done is I've started scratching this out. I really need a hoe because uh, I've raked this out with a hard rake. But this stretch here, you can see it. This stretch here is where my wildflowers are going to be. Not the happies and the amaranth. Love lies bleeding. Uh, but the hollyhock and the blue bonnet, if any of those will grow. Uh, all right here. So today is day Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, five. Today's day five. Today's day five of the 100 days. Uh, more later. If you like these videos, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. See you next time.